When the evil sorcerer Navar was defeated in the ultimate battle, it seemed we had banished his villainy forever. But now, as Navar drains the magic from this land, it appears he has found a way to return. Trapped by the magic that sent Navar into exile, I too am bound to this desolate realm. So the land needs a new protector. Transformed by the magic of my staff of power, this champion is finding true warriors to save us from Navar and his demons. Sixteen of the bravest and most worthy have answered my call. To succeed in the quest ahead, they must show courage, strength, agility, and resourcefulness. Who will conquer my challenges? Who will reach the grand tournament? Who will be named the second of my true warriors? My name is Raven. Let the challenges begin. Warriors have braved the journey here in the quest to become a true warrior. Four conquered the challenges and defeated Navar's last hand to reach this, the Grand Tournament. There out in the trees come four brave challengers, each hoping to win the tournament and be named as a true warrior. are fast approaching, but reaching me here is not the end of this race. There is a treacherous scramble beyond. The warriors must reach the treasure rings and return here to me. to finish. After a fall, Atra of the Stags comes last. Let us meet the warriors who made it here. Carpel is my name. I'm a great warrior and I won my heat with the bears. I know the Grand Tournament will be hard, but nothing scares me, so I'm ready to face lots of new challenges. Warrior's race was really fun and really amazing because even though I was against really fast people, I still managed to get in first and win six rings. I'm Sateo. I won my heat with the Wildcats and I'm back ready to battle again in the Grand Tournament and prove to everyone that I have the skills to become the true warrior. Warriors race was really good but really hard because you had to go down a very steep hill and climb back up it so it was mostly about stamina. I'm feeling quite tired but really good because now I'm in second place. I'm Kahira and I won my heat with the wolves. I made it through the portal to the grand tournament and I'm ready to prove that I am strong enough to become the true warrior. Warrior's race was very difficult. At the start when I was running down, I saw Axe for fall. I lost my concentration and just tumbled down. I think you need to fall to be able to pick yourself back up again and that's just how it works. I'm Axra. I won my heat with the Stags and now I'm in the Grand Tournament. I'm here to win. Warrior's race was quite disappointing. Unfortunately, my foot got caught and um, I'm just quite angry at myself because I didn't really do that well and I know I could have done better. Welcome, brave warriors. Your challenges and the weeks that brought you here confronted you with many dangers, but Navar's demons are most hazardous of all. And while his vile demons have been banished back to their perfidious master for now, the tournament is only just begun. Carpel. 
you reached me first. So you will start the tournament with six golden treasure rings. So Teo, you were second to reach the top. So you will start with five. Kahira, you will start with four rings. Axra, you will be placed fourth and will be awarded with three rings. Hold on to each ring with care, for when the time comes, it will be the warrior with the fewest rings who must leave this quest. And should you reach the last stand, it will be the warrior with the most who shall have the greatest advantage over their comrades in the race to be named a true warrior. The grand tournament begins now. Are you ready to face it? I'm prepared to face the challenges to come. I'm feeling ready about the grand tournament and I'm feeling prepared and I'm just going to give it my all. I'm going to use my strength and ability to go through the grand tournament. I'm ready to face whatever comes my way. Quickly, warriors. Navar's demons are in pursuit. Warriors, while this water looks clear, it has been turned into an instrument of evil by Navar's vile touch. The only clue to this is the noxious fumes it gives off that can blind an unwary warrior. We risk this danger because Navar has left golden treasure rings hanging above the river. These you will need to continue your quest. The only way to reach them is to use the warrior's seat. One of you will take their place on the seat, while the other warrior will stand here in safety. It will be their task to tell the demon how to move the warrior's seat. But beware, for the demons will always reverse the instructions given to them. Blindfolded to protect them against the noxious fumes, the warrior will rely entirely on these instructions if they are to steer the warrior seat to reach the rings. Should the warrior on the seat touch the water, then they will lose all their precious rings. Warriors, do you understand the challenge before you? Yes, yes Raven. Raven! Then take your places and let the challenge begin. Carpel and Axra brave these cursed waters first. Demons left. Demons, higher. They must reach as many rings as they can without Demons. touching the skulls stop, or stop, the water. That's why you really need to stay tight, keep those feet up, the bars in the water. Demons, right. A narrow escape and they still have no rings. Demons, start. Demons, lower. Stop, start, start. Demons, right. Demons start, stay really still, okay? Reach your arm out, your left arm. Keep your feet, keep feet, feet, feet. Keep going. Backwards, it's kind of backwards. I honestly can't reach that far. Yeah, you just had it, you just had it. There, catch it, catch it. The first yeah. ring. Demons to the right. It seems Carpel has mastered the instructions, but the sands Demons are running quickly. Lower. Demons start. Okay, there's one behind you, Axra. Right behind me? Yeah, right behind you. How far? Bring it up a bit. Yeah, there, there. Off the... Hit, catch it, swinging, swinging. Wait, keep your arm still, you're gonna catch it there. Yeah, all right, next okay. one. Demon Two rings gathered. Very fast. Can they find more before the sands run out? Demons start, start. Demons to the left. Demons start. Demons lower. Escaping the Demons water, start. Axra must okay, avoid right these cursed you. skulls. There's a, there's a skull on your right hand side, so use your left hand. Up, there, yeah, there, there, you got it, you got it, you got it. Careful with the 
skulls. Okay, demons lower. Yeah, you got this. Demons start. There's, it's right next to your eyes. Hand up a bit. Tiny bit. Yeah, there. You got it. A okay. fourth ring now, received demons, from Naval's fire. trap. These warriors are doing well. Demons stop, stop. Demons lower. Demons stop. Okay, you're gonna have to reach forwards a lot, okay? Right. You, got this. you can put your feet down. Right. You might need to. You positive. Yeah. Beware the skulls, warrior. Okay, now reach forward as far as you can. There's a rope there. Re your, your fingers are about touching. Oh gosh. Okay, right. forwards. Just touch a skull. Right. Our ring okay. is lost. Just grab that ring, then we can get to four. There, forwards. To the left. Forwards. You've got it right in front of you. Grab it. Grab the rope. Grab the rope. There, grab the rope. There. A ring recovered. Touch the skull. And lost again. The sands run out. Or your seat. For me, it was quite scary because I'm over a river and I'm blindfolded, so I'm not knowing what was going to happen. Unfortunately, I touched the skull twice. Given the instructions to the demons was really hard because they were doing the reverse of what I was saying, and it was quite hard because I kept forgetting that they were going to do the opposite. Now, Kahira and Sateo must seek the rings above the river. Demons, go right. Start. Demons, go down. These warriors start by breathing start. the skulls that cost the previous right, team Satea. two rings. Yeah, I want you to reach out behind you. Reach around, that's it. Now go, take your arm up and reach out. Feel around, feel around, feel around. Up. There, can you feel it? Yeah. Our first ring is taken. That's it, well done. Demons, go up. Demons, start. Demons, go right. Demons, start. Demons, go down. Start. Right, uh, Satea, yeah? can you reach out right in front of you with your left hand? Keep, reach out even more, can you go further? Oh, nearly got it, further, 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 even more. Can you feel it? Yeah. There, you got it, well done, nice. A second Demons, ring. Demons, go up. And a third. Right, demons, it seems these warriors have a taste for gold. Start. Demons, go left. But they are now perilously close to the water. Stop. Right, so Taya, this one is right behind you. Okay. Right, keep your feet up because we're near the ground. Wave your left arm behind you. Can you feel it? Can you feel the rope? Put your arm down a little bit for me and put it to the left. Can you feel it? No. So Taya, you touch the water. Navar's curse strikes. In Warrior's seat, I think we did well and we worked well together as a team because we managed to get three rings, but unfortunately, we just touched the water, which sadly means that we've lost them all. In the next challenges, I feel prepared to work my hardest so I can get some rings and not let my teammate down. Following Warrior's seat, Soteo and Kahira's misfortune leaves them with the same number of rings as after the first challenge, while Carpel and Axra add three more rings each, taking them into first and second place overall. Let us go on to the next challenge. Now is your chance to gather golden treasure rings while we are free from Navar's vile creatures. Here before you is the challenge of Towering Heights. The ring hangs above you. The means to reach it lies before you. 
you must use the blocks here to construct a way to reach the ladder. Then one warrior will need to climb to reach the gold. Axra, Kihira, you will make up one team. Carpel, Soteo, you will form the other. Warriors, do you have what it takes to claim the treasure? I feel prepared to work my hardest to get some rings. I think I'll be able to complete it to the best of my ability and I think Axra and I will work well together. Then take your places and let the challenge begin. Okay, let's put four blocks on the bottom to start. Yeah, four blocks. Make a little swell. Aksra and Kahira must work together to reach this ring. Right. Yeah. How many? I reckon two. two? Okay. Yeah. Start going and then the blocks. Do you want to put these the other way? Yeah. Alright, you must stand on this now. Nice. Yeah, now put one foot on there, see your balance. To reach the ring, first, you must build to the ladder. I'm doing, I'll hold it for you. Nice, now I'll hold it, I'll hold it. Alright, there we go. Yeah, we're good. We're nearly at the ladder. Okay, alright, get ready. Go. As the tower builds, the yep. sands run down. Move quickly, warriors. How many more? Here. Alright. Okay. Stay there. Okay. Yeah. Stay as still as you can. Alright. Stay there. I reckon it might topple a wee bit. Wait, 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 wait. Alright, yeah. A shaky tower, but okay. teamwork. Alright. One foot on the other one. Got that? Yeah, I'm good. How many more? I reckon just one more set of two. And I'll one be able to get my two? foot off. Yeah. Okay, do you think we should put them the other way? Um to make it steadier? Yeah. Okay, what I really need you to do is just stay still at the minute. And okay. I'll move oh. over. Alright. Can you reach it or not? Um, okay. Alright, yep. Have you got it? One more block. Will they stand or fall? Yeah, lovely. Yep. Stay there. Beautiful. Do you reckon we can do it with this one? Yeah. Stay right that. Actually, do you, can you reach it? I'm going to hold the tower. Wait, I might. Yeah, hold the tower. I might be able to reach it. I'm up. You're up? Yeah. Yeah. been successful in this challenge feels amazing just to know that we've done it and we've worked well and we've completed it. I felt like I was going to fall on the last one because when I looked down the middle it was splitting apart but I was worried it was going to topple over and then we'd lose a ring but we didn't lose a ring, we got a ring. So Teo and Carpel are next to take on this towering challenge. Where? Like push them both, push them all this way. Yeah, yeah, I, like this. I can have one more here, I can have one more here. Put one here. Okay. Okay, right. Now let's go. Carry on building the top now. Okay. Should we do that? Yeah. A one. firm foundation. But can they build it high enough and fast enough? Okay. So we can fit another one on here. Wait, where do we want it here? Yeah. Okay. And that one on the top. Now it's three. Now it's two. Grab 
slow, slow, slow and steady. Slow, slow. Yeah. Okay. Can you climb? Wait, put your feet. Put your feet back on the thing. Do like monkey bars. Okay. Oh, do you need another block? Another block. Quick. Quickly, warriors. You have little time. Okay. Malala. Slow. Malala. Okay. Can you do that? Okay. Okay. Feet, feet. Yeah, you got it, you got it, you got it. Incredible strength from Sotil. Yeah. And the ring is yeah. taken. Yeah. We decided to go with a pyramid structure because it would act like stairs but it would have a sturdy base at the same time. Once I got onto the ladder, I was trying to pull myself up. For the first time, I wasn't quite high enough. Then the second time, I just used my arms to pull myself up onto the second part of the ladder. With each challenger gaining one more ring, the Warriors' places remain the same, with no one gaining an advantage this time round. Carpel leads, Akshra follows, with Soteo and Kahira in need of more rings to catch them. My staff tells me that Raven of Old needs to speak with me. You summoned me, Raven of Old. I did. I am here to give you a warning. Navar knows that the grand tournament has begun. The last stand the warriors will face will take place on the cursed lake, but first, the warriors must reach it. Do you know what he is planning? No, not as yet. He has shrouded much of the area in magic, and I cannot see what he is doing. But when I know more, I will call for you. Thank you. We will move with caution. I wish you well. You have already encountered some of the danger Navar has conjured in the forests of our land. But there is not only peril amongst these trees, there is also opportunity. Look about you and you will see these ancient trees conceal golden treasure amongst their boughs. The challenge is to race each other to the top to take it. Axra, Carpel, you will race first. Let the challenge begin. Speed, strength and agility will be tested here. A second fall for Carpel. I'm feeling oh. super hyped for the next challenge. I managed to get um, the rhythm going because I have a wee rhythm that I do when I climb up the tree. I'm disappointed because I planned out what I was going to do in advance, but when I went to do the actual challenge, I kind of froze and didn't do what I'd planned. Now, Sateo and Kahira must climb. There is a struggle for these warriors, but as they lie in third and fourth places, one must take the gold to improve their chances of staying on the quest. the top I felt like I like I had this like I knew that I just have to lean over and grab the rings and then I'd won so it felt really good. I'm really disappointed about my first game with Sateo because I feel like I could have done better and I should have calmed myself down and not panicked. Each warrior now has a second chance to take the rings they need. 
Kahira stumbles and Carpel takes the lead. Carpel is victorious. Yeah. I'm feeling relieved that I won the second game. I felt quite nervous when I was the very, very top of the tree because if I'd missed, all that I'd worked hard for would have been gone to waste. At the end of game two against Carpel, I was really disappointed again because after the first game, I wanted to do better, but that's just how it is. Now, Axra and Soteo go head to head. Axra wins. When I was climbing with Soteo, I felt quite nervous because I I saw her do her climb and I, I saw that and I was really nervous going up against her. I did lose my second game, but I'm really glad though that I did win the first one. With the treasure gathered from the treetops, Carpel keeps her lead, but with Axra now only one ring behind. Soteo's win puts her three rings clear of Kahira, who has one more day to escape last place and stay on this quest. Warriors! In the challenges today, you have battled and defeated Navar's demons. You have escaped his traps and scaled fearsome heights. But while you have shown your skills to reach this point, at the next setting of the sun, one of you will leave this quest to return home. Stay this night under my protection. I will keep you safe from Navar's demons until the sun rises. Then your quest to become a true warrior will begin again. Next time on Raven, the grand tournament continues and four more grueling challenges await. And at the end of the day, one of these warriors will leave the quest. <laughs>